you guys here and here and time to show you guys how to get the feral for free in quad mobile the free version just came out with season six so i'm gonna show you guys how to get it it's pretty simple um i think with all the leaks and that kind of stuff i think most people thought the free weapon was going to be the hbr e3 but instead we got the feral so that only leaves the hbr e3 and the razorback as the weapons we haven't received yet so i guess they're doing like one like releasing one weapon for free that was originally paid, you had to pay for every season, I guess. I don't know, I guess that's how they're doing it. But this season we have the Pharaoh, so it's pretty easy to get. I'm gonna show you guys how to, show you guys how to do it. So once you load up COD Mobile, click on event on the left side, go to seasonal. Now they have a new challenge system here. I guess for every season is what it looks like it's gonna be because it's lasts the whole season. So different challenges you can do for rewards, you get battle pass, XP, you get some like other stuff like weapon XP cards, weapon skins, that kind of stuff. The boot camp mission is just like the first mission, the I guess the introduction mission. If you go to close quarters masters, you can see here the key reward for this one is the Pharaoh Bandit and some battle pass XP. So you go through do some challenges, basically it's using SMGs with different attachments. So this one just the first part is just getting kills with SMGs, then using the PDW with the holographic sight, PDW with quick draw and two other attachments. Then the MSMC with no attachments. Then the cheat comb with a single attachment. And then once you do that cheat comb mission, you get this mission here. Kill 20 enemies with the cheat comb equipped with quick draw and any other attachment. Only one other attachment. Then you unlock the, the default pharaoh. No skin at all. And then you keep going. You get kills with the pharaoh. And then finally, use the pharaoh to quick draw and any three attachments. You get the Feral Bandit. This is the skin here. Pretty solid skin. This is the only way to get the Feral for free. So this is your chance to get. You have a month to do this, so plenty of time. Weapon kills increase reload speed. So it's pretty cool they added this new section. And there's other missions too. You can unlock this Locust if you didn't get it. I think it was available in Season 4, I think, maybe. The Ranked Season 4 or 3 or something like that. No, Ranked Season 4. I don't know. I don't remember. It's one of the ranked seasons. I don't know. We can unlock the Locust also. You can get the No Skin Locust. And then unlock the flow, Flowing Bronze Locust. So other missions too. You can get character skins and that kind of stuff. So that's pretty cool. I really like this section. In the future, I know they will be adding in the... This is where they're going to add the Cordite in and the Cryo Bomb. So I believe they said May 15th is what it is. There's a loading screen that shows you the Cordite and the Cryo Bomb are coming May 15th. I guess they're coming in this section here, so it's going to be challenges and that kind of stuff to unlock both of them. I imagine those challenges are going to be a little bit harder than these challenges here because you're unlocking like a new weapon and new tactical equipment. So we'll have to see how that goes, but I don't think it's going to be too hard. It might be time consuming. Like the KN44 challenge was kind of time consuming. It wasn't like hard, but it just took a decent amount of time. I imagine the same thing for the Cordite. I imagine the Cryo Bomb won't be too hard or that time consuming, honestly. I imagine it'll involve like killing flash enemies or stunned enemies or something like that. The Cordite, probably just getting killed or like, playing a certain amount of team deathmatch matches or same, similar to what the KN44 was, I don't know. But that is May 15th. But for now, you can unlock the Pharaoh if you haven't already got it. You can see in my gameplays, I already have the Pharaoh Dream Crystal. I got it in the crate. I forgot what season that was. I think that was three. Maybe. I remember I got it in my first crate. So, I got really lucky there and unlocked it then. I think that was the first legendary weapon. Actually, no, the second. The Holiday Skins were the first legendary one. The DLQ33, I think. But anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully it's easy to get this skin. I, the challenges look pretty easy to me. Thanks for watching. Peace.